Did you uh did you see that uh the last joint Scorpion's Revenge? No. The animation joint? Nope. You took the TV. You slipping. I mean you had a set of amount of time to watch this shit. If you haven't watched it in that time, then look, I need my shit. How can I watch anything in time if you take the television? It, now time doesn't matter because you took the TV. That's the most selfish shit. That's worse than you eating all the cereal. I right? gave you five days to watch it. If you don't watch it, I take my shit back because I got shit that I need to, to watch. You know we share a TV set. And we stop sharing a box of cereal because you would eat all the shit anyway. So I, I decide to, to, to cosplay you and I eat all the shit so you know how it feels. That, and that's why I stopped buying the good cereal too. I buy the good shit. I, I, I'm all happy in the morning. All right, or sometimes at night, cause I, I, you know, I feel like having a bowl of cereal. I go in there with the bowl and 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 everything, and then you still got the box there sitting on top of the fridge, and I shake it, and it's light as fuck. So what'd you expect me to do? You are Petty Labelle. You know that you are literally Petty Labelle. Okay, all right. So if if, if I'm Petty, and you greedy, what does that make us? What, is, what does that make us? If I'm petty, you're still greedy. I'm petty because you eat my shit. I gave you a week to watch it. If you don't watch it in that amount of time, then listen, you got to find a way. You better get your phone or something like that. Put put the put the blanket over your head and look at the phone. And, and, <laughs> no, and, no, no, no. Oh, now you don't want to do that. No, I am not. I am not creating my own blanket IMAX thing. No, fuck that shit. I haven't done that shit in three days. I ain't doing that shit no more. You find a way. Just like Jeff Goldblum says, life finds a way. You find a way to, to get the maximum experience for, with, with what you got. Nothing! 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 You just don't turn it off! Anyway, they got a new joint coming out called Battle of the Realms. I didn't know anything about this. The trailer randomly dropped. The Mortal Kombat animation joints are top notch. Scorpion's Revenge was incredible. That movie was incredible. So this, by right, is a day one for me. I don't know when it comes out, but uh, let's check it the fuck out. Come on, you two. What the fuck you doing? Oh, I forgot. It's a fucking delay. All right. Rated R. Strong, bloody violence. Some language. So, okay. Cool. Throughout. Why does this shit keep getting stuck? Come on, you two. What the fuck are you doing, man? Can you play the goddamn thing? There we go. Doing. Yes, come to me. Oh shit, okay. Come to die. Whoop his ass. Ooh, damn, okay, alright. Scrap it. That's a fucking hammer. Alright, okay. Okay, I, I'm glued, I'm, I'm, I'm tuned in. Shao Kahn. Lord. Woo! <laughs> Damn, damn. I offer an end to the bloodshed. A final tournament that will determine not just the future of our realm, but the others as well. Nice, Kung Lao. A tournament? Like a, what, karate tournament? It's a whole thing. I'll explain later. Hmm. I like Greetings, it. Greetings, warriors of Earthrealm. Welcome to the final Mortal Kombat. I don't never believe mind. that. That sums it up. Right. Mm -hmm. It's never the final. Maybe we're gonna fight. So, so pure. And no more combat. Yeah. You are that child, okay? Are you okay. Ready? I've been waiting a long time. Thanks, so. So have I. Ooh. Fight. This is the end. Sexy ass yes. Damn. 
Bro, animation is so much better because they do whatever. It's like no, 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 no limits. Kicks to the beat. Punches to the beat. Mm. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Mortal Kombat Legends Battle of the Realms. Let's rip somebody hard out. You shall pay for my brother's death. Ooh. On digital and Blu-ray. Oh, so we can. All right, it's not theater, so we can steal it. Motherfucker, don't admit to that shit. Don't incriminate yourself. Don't you don't ever say that shit, man. We're gonna we're gonna legally purchase it at the at, at the at the proper location. What the fuck, man. You you the type to to rob the bank and then be posting a video on Instagram like, yeah, I just robbed the bank. I got all the money here. Look at it. Look at it. I robbed that bank right there around the corner. This is where I'm staying. That type of shit. I don't do that. Them dumbass rappers that be doing that shit. You you that's that's the same thing. Yeah. That... You don't want to admit to stealing the fucking movie. I don't I don't ever steal movies. No. Ever. What I meant was I would. I didn't mean steal. I meant I was going to steal the joy away from the person standing behind me in line because I'll be the one taking the last available DVD. That's what okay. All right. That's all right. Yeah. Okay. There you go. That's yeah. better. Well, That's you, better. You gotta. You have to give me a chance. Let me. Finish. I was wondering where you were going with that shit. I'm like, wait, hold up yeah, now. What sure. the fuck are you talking about? But then, all right, you okay? I'll let you have that. That's stupid. I'll let you have that. I mean, you have your moments, but this right here is going to be dope. Scorpion's Revenge, and you got to see that shit. Was dope. No holes barred, rated R. It was violent like this trailer. Bars, like yeah, it was it was crazy, yo, like, like uh, uh Scorpion right from the beginning because they show they 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 show what happened to his family and all that. Right when yeah. that happened, that motherfucker snapped. That motherfucker snapped, and they showed all of that shit. Brutal as fuck. I, Mortal Kombat itself is a it's it's a violent game. Mm -hmm. The movie that came out this year was dope to me. I mean, mm -hmm. people, Hell yeah, everybody hated it. I just hey, people are just so fucking nitpicky now. I'm like I, I get I get tired of this shit. Like I really get annoyed with the shit. I'm done. Like they they're so nitpicky to the point where I'm like, all right, well if if, if it's so whack to you, then you make the shit. Then you you go ahead and do it since you know so much. You know what's good and, and what's bad. Apparently, you can do better. So go ahead and do better. Stop stop sitting there bitching. That like, fucking like, armchair director bullshit. Like, what if we like this, right? Mm -hmm. But a, a lot of people don't. They get mad at you for liking it. Oh, I can't trust your judgment because you like a movie that I don't like. So, that, personal ref man, opinion. Like, what the fuck? That shit right there irks the fuck out of me. Oh, I can't trust you because you like this movie. You like, and that I, shit was whack. I, 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 but we, when, when every motherfucker on earth said The Witch was a masterpiece as far as horror. And when we didn't like it, we were bad guys for that shit. Every time I hear that shit and somebody say that, I'm like, you can kiss my entire ass. Cause just just because you don't like the shit, that that's not that's not the end all be all. That don't mean oh it's whack. Motherfucker, that means you don't like it. That's your opinion. If I like it, that is my opinion. Okay? If that's my opinion. And just just because I like something you don't like, if that means that if that means you can't trust my judgment, then fuck it. You just can't trust it. Kick rocks, roll out, move on. Like, I'm I'm not in charge of liking what you like. It's exactly. Not my job. I'm not here to please Thank you. you. Thank you. I am not here to please you. I'm here to please myself. And what I like, I like. I'm here to tell you this is what I like. This shit is dope. If you don't agree with that shit, then that's fine. Exactly. That's exactly. fine. And and we can we can agree disagree because people don't see eye to eye on shit all the time. And if, if honestly, if everybody liked the same shit, life would be boring. Yep. We'd, we'd be mindless drones. Like, oh yes, it's great. Everything is great. Okay, if we can disagree on shit and then have a discussion on why exactly you didn't like it, and I'll tell you why I liked it, and we can either come to an understanding but or just life. disagree. That is what makes life enjoyable. Niggas curse me the fuck out every day when I say that I like Royce the Five Nine way more than I like Nas. People say, "How the fuck can that happen?" To me, it's personal preference. I've listened to Royce the Five Nine in a different, you know, I like I, I like what he says. Mm -hmm. Maybe I like his delivery better than Nas's. But somebody might, somebody else might like Nas way more. Mm -hmm. Like a difference in opinions is, is what makes entertainment good to me. This movie might be excellent to us, but fifty other people might say, "Man, that was trash." This, was trash this motherfucker died too fast, and whatever like that. And the thing is, like, you got, you got, you got a, 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 
you got different kinds of people. You got some that, you know, like some things, don't like other parts of it, which is fine. You got some that maybe it's not their thing. And then you got the other ones that just are so spoiled by good entertainment, they want to nitpick everything. Oh, this animation was whack. I don't like the way his arm looked here. His hair was... I'm like, shut your dumb ass the fuck up. Like that nitpicky shit. Like, come on, man. I ain't got time for that. Look at this shit. Everybody in here looked amazing to me. Every character. Every single character looked amazing. And if you ask me, I can't see this movie being anything less than perfect because mm-hmm. it seems like they did everything they're supposed to do. Yeah. So, and because I'm a Mortal Kombat fan, they did no wrong in this trailer. Exactly. They did absolutely no fucking wrong. Exactly. The only thing that was the biggest lie in this trailer was the nigga saying, this is going to be the last and final tournament. Tournament. Yeah, yeah, yeah. the fuck right, nigga. You, right. You, know, you, know, you know he lied because that's, 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 that's Shao Kahn. Mm-hmm. Shao Kahn is a lying motherfucker lying anyway ass, with him that dumbass hammer. He's that, a politician. That's what he is. Exactly. Lying the motherfucker hits you with the hammer, start laughing, and then tell you another lie. Like, nigga, get the fuck. Get your big ass out of here. the last kill. Really? Like, we know that shit is bullshit. But I'm looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to it because, like, they got a good track record when it comes to animation joints. Like I said, Scorpion's Revenge was incredible. That shit was was was, was extra dope. And, if, and since you haven't seen it, we might have to we might have to watch that. That's fine. I'll watch it again. But yeah, I'm definitely looking forward to this. This looks good, and it's a day one for me. Whenever it come out, it's a day one. Shit. Mm. This is like more. Outrun. Who you really are. Mm-hmm. Where was this nigga in Endgame? Mm. Ooh, where were you in Endgame? Who are you? That's his name. That, that's, that's who he is. Yo, that's his signature. Sign here, son. What do you do when you sign here? <laughs> 